Hi there. So in this video, we are going to take a look at queues in VB.NET. So first thing, open Visual Studio and create one console VB.NET application. Now here, you will have empty projects such as this. Here we are going to create our queue. So queue is a type of collection where you can find that elements are added into collection in a first in first out method. Okay. So when you use in queue method, it will add the element one after another and when you use DQ to remove those elements it will also go in the same first in first out fashion so let's create our first queue so doing queue as queue of let's say integer and here we have to specifically call the class queue of integer now here I want to add q dot in q to add some values. So I'm gonna add total four values. So we start from five, 10, 15, and then 20. Okay, now to access these list of elements from our q, we use for each and here element adds integer in q okay and we use console dot right line to output your element okay and we use console dot read to read through those set of values okay now as you can see our value 5 10 15 and 20 will be outputted on console in first in first out fashion okay so let's take a look at that okay as you can see in queue method will add them in 5 10 15 20 okay same way they will be accessed through our for each loop now if you want to remove your elements then you make use of dq method Okay. we are going to access the first element file and then it will be removed with the help of DQ and rest of the 10 15 20 will be in our for each output so let's start again and see the output as you can see by calling DQ method it will remove the topmost value from your queue and then 15 20 will be outputted as per our for each loop. So you get the idea of how to output values from your queue with this for each loop. As well as you learn how to insert value within your queue within queue and remove from queue using DQ method. So this was a short demo on queues in VB.net.